Hello YouTube, this is Clattered Assassin with MMOAttack.com and we are looking at League of Legends today. Um, as usual, you guys can uh, go around, check out uh, the description, you know, look for the uh, website there and check out any free games they have up there, any MMOs, any of, the, any of that. And um, yeah, so looking here, uh, I'll be playing Teemo today and as there's only one Teemo on the screen, uh, people who are my regular followers can probably guess that um, this is another Smurf account. I know I have a lot of them. And what, who am I likely to be going up against? I'm going to be going bot lane. So chances are, all right. Uh, it doesn't look like they have a jungler. I forget about that at low levels. Um, yeah. So we're going to go ahead. Uh, I've been looking at a guide for this actually, and. It says to go for this and a health potion. So, I'm uh, gonna go ahead and do that, you know. It's just... Alright, so I'm apparently going top with Akali. Uh, you know, just crazy crap today. So, I'm gonna grab Blinding Dart first. Um, let me see. Corky's a good range. Nautilus is down there to help him out. Uh, me and Akali are kind of squishy, but... Um, I, I think this will work out. I think it, it'll work out if I'm not being silly about it. You'll notice already that I have some ability power on my uh, rune page, or, well, on my character. This is because I already have a rune page up, and I'm working on getting that... Well, no, actually, I think that's from the Masteries, but, you know, that's alright. Um, so for right now, I actually have this guide up and available. Um, I've been looking at it for a while, I've just been trying to memorize this stuff, but, um, so far it seems like it's a really worthwhile guide. You can sell off a lot of items to get other items, and so on and so forth. Um, it really, oh man, Nautilus just takes out our quirky, I don't, wait, I'm confused. Huh? How did, what? Oh. Nautilus, gotcha. I was, I was looking at that, I didn't... I thought it was Quirky that got killed. Apparently it was Nautilus. Um, yeah, okay then. Well, anyway, uh, as I was saying, uh, this guide is really... It really seems to be worthwhile. The guy really knows what he's talking about. It's just my skill that needs to be, you know, increased. Ooh, going after Top Gun. Let's poke at Jarvan there. I actually chose the right skill for this lane because uh, if it had been a high damage character, I would have wanted a uh, blinding dart first. But it was just lucky for me that uh, I hit blinding dart and got top lane. If I hadn't gotten top lane, uh, I would have had to have blinding dart against Corky. Oh man, he is just going after her. Give some counter there. I mean, you know, it's just, it's really not that big a deal if I get hit right now because of this uh, regrowth pendant. But I do want to make sure I'm not being silly, and I just did. Gotta heal up off of that. Uh, yeah, so that was kind of stupid of me. But, you know, we're not gonna be able to push out until Akali hits level 6, and even then we might have some issue. Because this Jarvan is poking at us pretty hard right now. And I understand that Jarvan can uh, go DPS and all that, so that might be an issue. So, uh, that might be an issue, like I said. Uh, I just blinding darted him so that he couldn't get a hit off on me, but he still used his Q in order to smack me with that. And in order to get some damage off, so I'm going to go ahead and hit this health potion here keep poking at them, because they are not letting up here. They are not. But that's alright, that's why we have health potions. We're having some trouble here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab Blinding Dart up again. And, you know, we're just gonna... We're not gonna max this out, first off. Um, actually, according to the guide, I should probably get my Q up as much as my E, and then start working on move quick after level 13. Or at level 13, or something like that. I, I, I put one point into it by level 
Well, I'm gonna put one point into it at level four. Level six should have two, one, two, and one. Meaning two in Q, one in W, two in E, and one in R. So, we're gonna do... Uh, come on. Uh, poop. Oh, Akali, going after that one. What we really need to do is focus on this guy, but we can't because of this Jarvan. This Jarvan is just going after us, but... I don't know how he got the health back. He probably killed the unit. Going after that. You know what? I'm gonna lock this so that I can just. Oh. Armed and ready. All right. Sometimes I really don't like to have it locked up, but for now, I think this will work. I need to get ready for the Diablo 3 whenever that comes out, and this is a good way to do it. So. Let's see real quick. All right. Put one into move quick here. Do some damage there. It really should have been auto attack, then Q, then E, but I really wanted to help out uh, Akali. I didn't want her to get hit anymore, so I init I started out with the uh, Q there. Of course, we're not going to be able to take out this Cho'Gath because he's got such a high health re regen. They these guys are playing smart. I'm pretty sure these are smurf accounts, so... I don't know what to do here, honestly. The Smurfs. And they're gonna go after Akali. That's got a sting. Keep them from going after her for just a moment. Keep targeting uh, Jarvan and Cho'Gath. This way you guys can also see whatever it is I need to see, and I can see whatever I need to see, and you know, just all of that. Do some more damage to Cho here. Get some damage from uh, Jarvan. He's out of mana now. He's been harassing us so much. He can't do anything anymore. There we go. Now we're really starting to hurt him. Because he can't do anything. He's got to back or else... Ah. This Jarvan here. I mean, I, I don't know what to do against him, because I need to farm, honestly, and he's not letting me do that. I have all of 15 farm right now. That's horrible. And she's just going to take my farm, too. Alright. Oh, I'm dead. I got ignited right there. Yeah. It's kind of what I was expecting, but, you know, I mean, again... These are Smurf accounts. I'm a Smurf account. You know all of that. So let's go ahead and take out, take a look what's going on here, because honestly, it, it just doesn't seem like much is going on. Uh, we have one in three. Akali and I are not doing as well as we should be. But now I can go over here, grab this Philosopher's Stone. That way I have more health, more regen, and I also have, I also have the um, extra gold per second since I'm not getting a lot of farm. So, yeah, you can see it here, gain an additional 5 gold every 10 seconds. Um, the health regen is going to be nice, the mana regen is going to be nice, because that means I'm not going to run out of mana for my blinding dart as much, although we haven't had any mana issues so far. Um, I overextended, I got myself killed. I know that. So, uh, I need to look at the guy's name that made the guide that I'm using, because I'd like to acknowledge him, but I don't know his name. I really don't. Jarvan is probably gone into uh, that bush, or he's backed out. Alright then. Time to farm then. Okay. La la. They don't have a jungler like I said before. Um, oh. Top gun is down. And I'm hit. And he is level six, so I'm not gonna be able to do much either. To either of them. Especially if he starts feasting on these minions here. And right, I need to lock this in again and poke at Jarvan. Alright. 
they have a good team composition here, and I just don't have any way to counter them. Uh, I really wish I did, but it's going to be very hard to take out Shogath yes, with that Jarvan around. Uh, if this was draft pick, which no high level d or low level does, um, probably would have done better off since I could have counter picked and yeah, you know. But all right. Um, for those of you who are wondering why I have another Smurf account, I am uh, currently trying to get into the playstyle of one character. That's it. I want to get better with one character and one character only. I'm gonna keep hitting that Jarvan there. He's gonna launch his thing and knock Akali. No, okay. She takes all the farm again, but all right, that's alright. We've got the uh, additional five gold. I'm probably gonna build a Kage's pick next because I need ability power and I need even. I just need more gold. So there she goes after that Jarvan. So what I'm gonna do now is set traps down so that we can get some semblance of protection around here. Alright, so, and again, some semblance of protection, always nice, you know? We're really knocking this drive himself down, it's really going fairly well. So, we're, I mean, it's its not a long shot, it's not horrible, it's just we're knocking his health down, and he's going to go after me again. Yes, sir. Boom, that mushroom. Good job, Akali. And now, boom, there we go. That trap did its work, and yeah. Um... Maybe I'm wrong, maybe they're not Smurf accounts, maybe they've just got excellent uh, communication. I really shouldn't be sticking around, but I'm going to because we need to get these hits on this tower. And these are a lot more important than, um... Well... Okay, no, they're not, but they're very important. So we need to get the hits on the tower. Uh, according to this guide, I don't even need to, um... I just got uh, wiped out there because I was waiting to get that first hit. I should have just backed off. Now, according to this guide, I should actually go for the sorcerer's shoes and then go after the uh, other things. Uh, go after... I don't even go after... Actually, I do need to go for a malady, I think. Uh, he says do not go for a nasher's tooth. The reason why is because uh, apparently the attack speed doesn't matter that much on Teemo. It matters a little bit, but not too much. It, I mean, it's just like, it's one of those weird things where his uh, E actually doesn't do a lot of stacking damage with his poison dart. It just does the flat damage. So whenever this poison is active, all you get is the uh, extra impact on the um, skill instead of getting even more poison damage. And while the extra impact is nice, it uh, doesn't help much. He also said don't farm with the mushrooms. So we blinded Cho, he's gonna come in, try to rupture. Alright, so, gonna keep going, you know, you know, you guys know the drill here. They're trying to poke at me because I guess I'm the biggest threat here. Uh, I'm gonna place, oh man, they've gotten rid of all of my mushrooms. So that's, that's a bad thing right there. Go in and plop this on down. Alright, so, yeah, this is a low level account. So I have to apologize for that, guys. I'm going to set this in the middle here. This one in the middle. I'm going to keep him out of that bush. Just kind of. Not not too much, but kind of. Oh, there's Cho. Alright, so we're going to keep going. And remember, lock in, lock in. This is probably going to help me out, and it's going to help my friend the people that are watching me out so they'll know what's going on I'll know what's going on and you know just all of that uh, I'm gonna set this here because people tend to avoid uh, yeah I don't know guys I mean I'm all two and two it's kind of bad but it's not horrible get that damage out on Jarvan um, 
yeah, so we're going to slowly ward it into their uh, jungle and everything else, just so we have that vision. Just so we know what's going on here. And again, you know. There we go. Alright, and taking that out. Rupture. Not surprised. Uh, you know, it's just how Cho'Gath plays. If he can get you with a rupture, he can come in with his other abilities and... Yes, sir. Hit Jarvan there, and hit Cho'Gath there. And, you know, he's getting ready to go after me with those other abilities as well. And I noticed that, so... I just randomly took 12 damage. I don't know where. I don't know where that came from. But, we're gonna keep going. Oh. Okay. Jarvan is the big problem here. Cho'Gath has to be able to lane. He's afraid of me, so... We've got them pushed down. You know, it's not going well because we don't have a tower down yet, but it's not. It's also not going well because I don't have a kill. I've only got deaths. Only deaths means crappy, crappy team. Sorry, guys. Wish I was better. That being said, I'm going to keep going. You know, I'm going to place a lot of mushrooms around. Because if they run into these things, they're going to take a good bit of damage, and that's always nice. Hit him with that. Didn't get the attack off. Thought I had, but I didn't. Oh, oh, that's a bad idea. I don't want them hitting my mushrooms. Oh, and... Tons of damage here. Alright, so, uh, yeah, Ignite's done. Uh, I'm not gonna heal up. There's really no point to that. I'm not gonna use heal there. He's taking a guess at where I'm hiding and failing. If he had come up any further... There we go. There we go. Akali got another kill, which is great because a fed Akali will destroy an entire enemy team. If they know how to play. And it seems like she does. He's trying to get that extra poke and I have no mana for my uh, trap. But that's alright. We don't rely on the traps, so... There she goes after Jarvan yet again. Oh shit. And dead. Alright, should have really seen that coming. I didn't see Kennen coming up from the river here. Um, we didn't get an MM, uh, an, MMI, uh, an MIA of mi uh, missing in action. So, that was another part of it. I also uh, deviated from that build a little bit. I grabbed the wrong thing, but... Oh well, it, it, uh, it doesn't matter at the moment. Uh, I'm 0-3 and 3. Kennen, or Akali, is 3-2 and 0. So, I mean, yeah. We're gonna get moving now. You know, high base movement speed and all that because of his passive W here. And a 10% increase in speed is still pretty good. So. We've got 34 CS, Akali has 59. Highest is Tuna, uh, Annie with 87, so, that's that's good. Oh man, they just take out mid turret now. Which means they're probably going to come top to take this turret down. Didn't see that cannon, so I'm going to start placing these down. They did manage to hit that, so I'm actually kind of surprised, but, you know, going to start placing these down in the river. We've got some sight now. Should have really seen that coming, honestly. But I was more focused on what I was doing and not uh, map awareness. So, I mean, that's my fault. And, you know, I'm, I'm not going to say, oh, hey, this is a horrible thing. I, should, I shouldn't have uh, trusted my teammates at this low level. It's not that. It's, a, we, it's just that we uh, weren't paying attention. So, that's our fault. Yeah. Two... Mid is still missing, and Cho is still missing, so... Uh, you guys know. I mean, it's decent stuff. 
Um, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and keep going. Go on after this, and, you know, this Jarvan's a little afraid of us here. I can understand, but I cannot at the same time. Shut down. And he just shuts down Kennen, which is excellent. So, we are now level 11. We're going to keep going, you know. Typical stuff, typical stuff. Going to place a mushroom there. He's going to be afraid to go near that bush now. Not just... Armed and ready. Here, like, not even... I don't know. He might not be because he is a tanky character. But he should be because these mushrooms will do a lot more damage now. They'll do, what, 400 plus 19 at the moment. Ahead. And, you know, I, I kind of know what I'm doing. Just kind of. I'm really working on making sure that I follow this build. Um, I didn't get something. I know I didn't get quite a few of the core items, but... I'm going with... Wham. Taking a lot of damage, though. Um, I don't have many runes, and honestly, I shouldn't have any runes on this account, because it's not even level 10 yet. So a lot of people are going to be like, oh, you noob, why are you buying runes at this level? Well, because the extra health on Teemo is really essential, because the extra magic penetration, no matter how little it is, is also really essential. Oh, he actually knocked me up. That's kind of crazy. Oh, we lost bottom now. And he's just taking us on. It's a little depressing, honestly. But, I mean, yeah. I have, they did manage to take this mushroom down. I'm going to go put these back in here. Because I'm not really fond of them killing off all mushrooms. So I'm going to place them randomly around here. Because if they don't see it coming, if they don't uh, expect it, you know, how can they counter it? How can they get a avoid it, you know? So we're, I'm just going to be placing mushrooms as much as I can around everywhere. Because that's really helpful. It'll really make sure we uh, get somewhere. I have a feeling these people are, have also warded. Because these guys are playing a little more um, tactically than most level 7s do. So... I don't know how Corky's doing, I just know I need to plot this here. Um, Alright, so as you can see, you can see like every single mushroom up there, which is pretty cool because um, they give w they give some minor vision and they let you, um, they basically let you know what's going on. Jarvan thinks he's free to farm, gonna have to correct that. We're gonna have to just, you know, play it smart. Be, just make sure we're doing the right things. Um, toxic shot and blinding dart are at level four, so I'll go ahead and get toxic shot off right here. And you know, Ooh. boom, hit both of those. And as you can see, tons of damage here on that Jarvan. Well, as you saw. Alright, I really wish I could help her out, but she got a little too far, a little too fast. Akali is now dead. <sighs> That's really her own fault. I couldn't stop that. So, I'm gonna get out, since Cho is chasing me. And as soon as I see that rupture, because I know he's gonna do it... Apparently he's not going to do it, which is good. But, can't do much right now. To be perfectly fair, to be perfectly honest. We just can't do much, you know. But we're, we're working on it. As a team, we'll be able to uh, take them out. Alright, there he goes. We got that one down. Good. Gonna start placing mushrooms down again, you know. Now we go after this tower. Oh, for some reason I'm taking damage. I don't understand. But they're defending this tower pretty hard. Akali's down on bottom. We've got Cho'Gath and Jarvan at mid, or at top. Not mid, sorry guys. Um, but they're at top, you know, we're just going after. And we're gonna, they're probably, yeah, they're coming down. So, I'm gonna start setting some traps down around here. Because we really need these traps. 
uh, for the vision, even if we don't need them for anything else. His, uh, Timo's... Timo's, uh, AP damage is pretty crazy, but... There's Draven, he's, uh, he's taking off. He, I don't know if he's afraid or if he's just being smart, but... You know, I mean, it's not... It's not what we should be looking at. We should honestly just be, uh, going about our goal and taking them out. I just had a hard top lane, that was it. I mean, there's not much past that. So... Yeah. After level 13, we go for move quick, which is the only skill we can level up besides our ultimate, and our ultimate only gets it every five levels. So at level 16, we'll be able to uh, you get our ultimate up one more time, and that should be it, I think. Uh, after this, I think, while I really like the cooldown reduction for his mushrooms, they're not necessary, especially since you're uh, kind of gimping your own combat effectiveness. Uh, after this malady, I think I'm going to work for a Lich Bane. As you guys can see, we've got a couple coming up. I don't know how they saw me, but alright. Alright, that was a... Uh, that sucked. I probably should have hightailed it out the other way. I didn't really expect Jarvan to be showing up, but, uh, again, live and learn, guys. If you guys are learning from my mistakes here, it's better because I'm... Alright, I need to get that Kage's lucky pick because I also need to go for a Deathfire Grasp. Then go for a Sheen. Ah. Uh, there we go. Alright, we're going for a Sheen so we can go for that Lich Bane. You know, all of that. Um, top is my MIA. We're just getting kind of pushed down here. It's uh, a little crazy. We're equal... Well, no, we are, we're actually leading in turrets, but that's about to change, I think, because they're still pushing down mid. They're not letting us do anything here. Um, after this Lich Bane, I think I'm going to go for something else. What's this cannon building? AP. All right. Most cannons uh, will build AP. Very few will actually build um, AD, but I've seen it happen. I've seen how well it works. So, you know, I mean, if you guys really are really interested... You can probably look up uh, Ankle Spankin and check out his uh, AP or AD cannon, and you'll see he's a lot. He's a he's a really good cannon. He's just yeah. Sometimes he can't throw his shit sh against you know. He's keeping sight for us. All right. Well, apparently they're not coming in here. Need to go blind this Corky. Alright. Simply me running around saved our Corky's life. That's good. So I'm gonna plop that there. Cho'Gath is over here. Alright, tons of damage on Cho here. I wanna take off Cho'Gath. I wanna take him out, honestly. Let me see, did he juke me? Yes, he did. An ally has he been got away. Alright then. Son of a schnitzel, he got out. You nope, got him. Alright, there we go. So, we finally got our first kill, guys. We finally got it. <laughs> it only took... how long? <laughs> Alright, it took 28 minutes to get that one kill, but we aced the enemy team. We should be able to push them now. And, yeah, so... Here we go. Off we go. Um, really, I need to be going to Ward Baron now, because chances are... I, I don't know how many of these people are Smurfs, but someone's going to lead them over there eventually. Yes, and sir. when they do, it's going to be kind of bad. Alright. There we go. There's Corky. There's Janna. I'm going to go ahead and back out. Uh, I want to place a mushroom down here, so I can see if someone goes in there. And... Our tank is going after it. That's alright. I'm going to take this down real quick, no problem. Chogath is hitting some mushrooms up in top there, up in their jungle, so that's pretty nice. And Janna hits that other mushroom. 
Oh man, it's kind of bad because they're taking out all my mushrooms, but it's good because I know where they're going. Reporting in. There we go. Oh, didn't get the farm on that. So obvious. Oh, hey, wait, what? Why is this missing? I just placed this down. All right, got to back out from Kenan because he definitely can melt us at the moment. Uh, once I get that Lich Man, though, I think we'll be able to take Kenan on. Uh, two, three, four. That's gone, so we're gonna keep going, you know, just hope for the best, guys. Hope for the best. Gonna place that down there. Um, yeah, I, I think we're doing all right, though, guys. Uh, I'm only one, four, and five, but with the assists, it gives me a decent amount of gold revenue. An enemy but... has been slain. Oh, good. They did a good job there. Jarvan is not one to be targeted since he's definitely going tanky here. Uh, Chogath is just naturally tanky and kind of hard to take out, so... I mean, you know, it's just how the, how, how the game goes. Um, let me see. His ultimate makes him really tanky, it's crazy. So... Alright. Oh, shoot. Don't have any mushrooms around, so I can't help him out. And I don't know why Corky stayed around, but obviously this a Janna is not going AP. She's going uh, something else. Uh, I don't know. Oh man, Annie going in all alone, getting wrecked on her own. I mean, oh my goodness, that's just crazy. All right, we're gonna go in. All right, gotta get out. Gotta get out that heal. Get out, get out, get out, come on, come on, come on. Timo! No, Timo! I should have, uh, I, I, I know what I should have done, but I didn't do it. Uh, magic resist is going to be really helpful here. They have a lot of magic damage. They have some ma crazy AD, but they have a lot of magic damage right now. Um, backing out that one time would have been a good idea. Oh, man. See, this is why I like to place it in obscure places, because of Oh, come on. Ah, yeah, he saw it, he wanted it, but we couldn't get him. Oh, there's Jogad. Bam. Alright. Well, obviously not much to be done here. Um, just wish we could have done some more damage. Got that Kage's lucky pick still, so I need to look what I need to build for this. Uh, Morellos are a fiendish codex at that. Alright. So, there's that. Um, gonna have to sell... Kage's lucky pit, or sell the uh, Philosopher's Stone to get the Blasting Wand, I think. This sells for 400. Alright, so go for this. Uh, where'd, where'd that go? There we go. Blasting Wand. Grab a Lich Bane. Uh, we still have the increased gold from the Kage's lucky pick, so um, we, we should be good on that. Um, Cho'Gath and Corky are about to take top. So I'm going to start warding our areas, because it looks like they're going to be in our jungle and everywhere else now. Armed and ready. They're really not going to give us a chance here. I can see that. But, this is a good thing, since we can place these... Wait, no. Nope. Let me see real quick. Four. There we go. Plop that down in the river. You can see them running along there if they do so happen to do to do that. Um, yes, sir. Hit the da, 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 da. Hit them even harder here. Place this here, because people still go up to Aren't top ready? lane around this phase, just not as often. Uh, I notice a lot of MIAs. I probably shouldn't be doing this. Um, chances are I'm going to get... Oh, no, there they are. All right, then. I'll push. There you go. Uh, you guys can see why the person said not to uh, go for the attack speed right off, because you don't even need it. Uh, at this point, oh my goodness, someone just got, they just took out our Nautilus, so that's a little sad, but do that, get the extra damage from the Sheen off. Um, I'm going to keep my W because I need to get moving as soon as possible. It's not going to catch up to me, which is a good thing. Um, they do have Baron, 
And like I told you guys before, uh, not all of these guys are Smurfs, but I yes, knew they were going to be led to Baron eventually. And they were. So I'm going to plop a mushroom down here. Because when Baron spawns, it'll push the mushroom out in some random direction. And we'll still get sight of him. So. <coughs> it's always good. Uh, sorry about the cough. And, you know, we're just going to keep going, keep going, keep going. Hope everything works out. Alright. So I'm going to do this. Um, we're going to get pushed, I think. Or we're going to get... Get my butt moving so I can save myself. Oh, he got me. I had no help, but. Oh! Our Cho'Gath get or our Corky gets killed, but he at least got that one kill, which is excellent, so. Uh, it's not worth it, but it was a good thing in any case. Um, I think by now I need to go for that uh, Death Fire. Does that still give the extra gold? No, I don't think it does. So, um, yeah. Oh, got some farm. Haha. -ha. Alright. Um. Oh, shoot. Nautilus is going to get taken down because these guys are very organized. They know what they're doing. Um, it's just a little depressing to see this. Our team has no coordination and theirs has a lot. She's gonna. Oh, she almost got away. Um, I still have to decide what I'm gonna do. I might just go for that Rabidons, or maybe I should go for the art or the magic pen. I don't know. Not right now. I don't know. So, I'm just gonna keep going. All right. So, uh, we're gonna. Uh, it's just not looking well in terms of kills. And he has a death cap already, which is excellent. Uh, actually, to be honest, I think I need to go for a Rod of Ages, as that's also in the uh, core build, I believe. But, um... Let me... Oh! Yeah. Here's Cho'Gath. Wham! No damage on him. At all. It's a little depressing to see that, but... I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And I'm going to die again, I think. Oh my goodness. Plop this down here and get going, because that really sucked right there. Honestly, that just... that was horrible. Um, alright. Let me see what the base attack speed is. It's 1.0. That's good. Um, right, so as I was saying, I need to go for that uh, Rod of Ages, which is... A very useful slain. item. It'll make me uh, not die as much. It'll give me so oh my goodness! It goes everybody. Enemy double kill. Only I had more mushrooms. Yes, sir. All right. There we go. I'm just gonna move over here. Um. Yeah. There we go. It's that. I'm not going to be able to do anything to defend this tower. Harass Jarvan a little bit because I've been annoyed with him all game. Oh! Oh! Come on! Come on, mushrooms! Oh! Yes! Yes! There we go! Oh my goodness. Get moving. Alright, that was funny as hell. That was, that was just... Oh my goodness. Oh, I ran right into that. Kinnon doing that lightning dash again, trying to take out some uh, minions here. I'm going to have to use this to farm because I don't want them pushing out too much. But uh, I'm also going to have to start placing mushrooms in mid. Or, yeah, in mid. So that's going to be kind of bad. Um, they're taking everything right now. But there's not much we can do about it. Wish there was. Um... I mean, I'm just working on it right now. I don't even have uh, anything useful right now, which is a little sad. Yeah, that see, that was even our blue, so I'll the head. even better. Um, how did they have it? We should have had sight on it. Oh well. Armed and ready. 
probably place a few mushrooms. Well, I'll probably place the one mushroom that I can place down right here. So there we go. All right. Keep moving, you know. Uh, just work hard at this because if we get a full build on this team, uh, the other team won't stand a chance. It'll be excellent. Let's see what this other quirky has. He's got an Infinity Edge, Trinity Force, Doran's Blade, and a Bloodthirster. So he's going to be really hard to take down, but our Corky is going for a more usual build. And it's good, it's just that this other Corky is kind of breaking the rules with uh, its standard standard um, item grabs. Like, certain items you're supposed to pick up, and he's not doing that. He's um, really screwing us over here, which is good. Oh shit, alright. Come on, come on, come on. Oh no. Set this down. Boom. Alright, run and gun Teemo. Run and gun Teemo. So now I have their blue and their red, which were probably ours in the first place. Um, yeah. So we're working on it. We, we're getting it, guys. I mean, it's not horrible. Oh. Your team has destroyed a turret. Damn, tons of damage on him. All right, I'm gonna set this here because it's a crossroads. People like to use it. Chugath is gonna be coming in. Um, yeah, here we go. Watch it. Oh man, there we go. Your turret has been destroyed. Oh, why can't I see that turret health? What? Oh, because we can't hit it yet. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. Alright, we need to get out because they're coming back up. I've got a lot of gold now. I mean, we should be yes, good for now. Oh, Jarvan is backdooring like no other. He's taking our turrets and everything. Look at that. Nautilus is taking their blue. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go for this blasting wand. I can still afford this. So I'm going to... I'm not that far off of my Rod of Ages now. Uh, I do need to start setting more. Oh, man. There go those minions. Um... Ah, they have us pretty hard now. Really just finding this a hard game, but this build is starting to work out. Um, I really have to thank the guy who made the guide for this, and I'll thank him in the credit or in the description on my channel, since I know that um Yeah. I know how it's gonna go. Um let's see real quick. Oh, there's Cho'Gath. There's Jarvan. I'm gonna get my ass out because I don't like this. Get him to run into that and get moving. He can follow me as much as he wants to. I'll just keep going. Alright. They're all going after Baron now. It's a horrible thing. Yes, sir. I think they got it already. Yeah, look at that. Your all right. Is I'm uh. I gotta go back. Because obviously people are getting killed again. Um. You know. Go after that Janna. Oh no, that Corky is following me. It's painful. I'm gonna start placing these down so they can hit those. There we go. Alright, gonna get moving again. Um, yeah, we're uh, having some trouble here. I should be able to defend the base with mushrooms uh, after a little bit, but right now it's not working out. Um, I, oi, just oi. I'm trying to grab that Rod of Ages, but it's uh... People are going to ask, why didn't you grab that earlier? Well, look at the uh, damage so far. Oh man. 
Alright, so another mushroom down. I need to defend this base, so I don't know what's going on. Why are they splitting up? Oh. Alright, so I'm gonna keep going, keep going, keep going, you know? Just hope for the best, and. Yeah. Gonna place that there because they have been counter jungling us and everything. And you, you're like, eh, you can't counter jungle if you don't have a jungler. Yes, you can. You can take their buffs, you can take uh, gold away from the enemy team. I'll scout ahead. Because of. You can take gold away from the enemy team. That, I mean, it's just that simple. Gold is the most important part of this game. Skill is great, but gold is probably the a most important. Two, three, um, granted, if a guy doesn't know how to play and he's getting. Oh shoot, Enemy killing there's no way I'm going to be able to help him um, at all. I kind of feel bad for Nautilus now. Yes, Wish I could help him out, but... Oh yes, there we go, he got out. Enemy They're not going to chase me, but they are going to go into the base and go after all of it. Shoot. I need to start placing some more shrooms down. Trying to kill my shroom there. It's kind of fun. Blind Corky. Get moving. Alright. They are going to take it out now. There I go. Uh, yep. So, it's gone. It is gone. It was a good game. Um, again, low levels. These guys obviously have a couple smurfs. They've got some experience. Um, my teammates, not so much, but that's all right. Uh, it was a good game. I didn't do too well, and I'm sorry for that. But um, you guys can see how viable this build is uh, whenever you actually go to play it yourself. Uh, you can probably look it up. It's one of the first ones that comes up. It's uh, if you look up APT Mo build, it'll be on Mobifier or. Was it Mobifier or was it Leaguecraft? I think it's Leaguecraft, actually. So go ahead, check that out. And once again, guys, uh, you know, go check out MMOattack.com and do that. That, that would be appreciated. Uh, thank you, and I hope you have a good day.